You can fish anywhere, but you catch fish in Louisiana. The state often called the sportsman's paradise catching a deal of its own. $60 million will go toward fishing piers, state park trails, boardwalks, and other recreational projects across Louisiana. That sportsman's paradise is not just a catchphrase. That is who we are. That is what we are. That's what drives so much of our tourism, which, which is great, but it's really about our quality of life, our way of life as well. The 23 projects in all will spread across nine parishes along Louisiana's coast, areas hit hard by the 2010 Deepwater Horizon oil spill. This money comes not from taxpayer dollars, but from the state's settlement with BP following that disaster. During that oil spill, Louisiana beaches and fishing areas were closed, recreational fishing access was limited, and camping and other recreational uses were diminished because of extensive oiling and cleanup activities. Under the settlement, the dollars must go toward recreational projects. State officials hope that investment will draw tourists back to Louisiana's coast to camp, boat, and fish. This is another case of Louisiana being smart about taking a bad situation and improving the well-being for our citizens. The Coastal Protection and Restoration Authority ultimately chose the projects with public input. Residents gave officials more than 300 ideas, from which the state narrowed down the list. There's a lot of need out there, but we felt like we selected those projects that have the most impact, the most value, and bring uh, the best services we could to the state. Exactly when all of these projects and improvements will open remains unknown, but coastal officials say some of the construction will begin by the end of summer. In Baton Rouge, Harrison Golden, Local 33 News.